Hi, in today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to change username on chess.com. So the first thing that you'd like to do, of course, is just go and open whatever browser you're going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here in my case, I'm actually using Brave. But of course, in your case, you can use any other browser it could be possibly working for you in your PC. Once you open that browser, make sure to go to this URL section and simply type chess.com and hit the enter button, and that should take you into this page. Of course, if you have an account, you can simply go and click on this login option on this left panel. And here you can enter your username or email, password, and check this remember me if you don't want to log in anymore. Of course, you can even log in with your Apple account, Google account, or Facebook account if you don't want to go through all the boring steps of create or logging in into your account. Or if you don't have an account, you can simply go and click on sign up from here or sign up from here. Both will take you to this page. And here, of course, You'll just have to choose a username, email, enter an email and password, and simply click at sign up. Of course, you'd like even to choose your chess skill level, new to chess, beginner, intermediate, or advanced. And also, you can sign up with Apple, Google, or Facebook, like login, if you don't want to go through all the boring steps of this is signing up, of this signing up. So once you're logged in into your account or you just created your account, you'll find yourself here in this home screen or the main screen of the chess.com. So as we said in the beginning of this story, we would like to change username on chess.com. And of course, if you want to do that, we can just go to this list panel and go to the bottom of it and click on settings right here. That should take you into this page. And as you can see here, you'll find username. Simply click on change and here you'll be able to change your username. Let's say an example, I'm just going to make it like tester uh xd and click on save and as you can see your preferences has successfully been updated now if i go to the home screen i'll find my username is changed i'm going to be good to go so that's actually for this tutorial i hope you like it thank you guys for watching goodbye